I'm gonna show you how these rods show up in house to your place of residence so you can use them. It's kind of a cool setup that they have to where you can use one or two rods and have multiple different varieties of techniques just using a couple rods with their twin tip technology. How's it going everybody? Welcome back to another video. My name is Ethan Preston, a Cast King Pro Team member here and welcome back to the Cast King channel and welcome once again to the series Outdoor Living with Ethan. We're going to be diving into the Casking Ice Rods today. When it comes to rods, Casking is no stranger to having a wide variety of rods from bass rods, walleye rods, your heavier big game fish, catfish rods, stuff like that. And now they have ice rods. I believe this is their second or third season of having a lineup of ice rods. Today with me I have the Casking Convert Series. This is the graphite rod with the real seat. I'm going to talk to you about the other options here as well. First, we're going to I'm going to show you how these rods show up in-house to your place of residence so you can use them. It's kind of a cool setup that they have to where you can use one or two rods and have multiple different varieties of techniques just using a couple rods with their twin tip technology. This is how it's going to show up at your place. So just like this, you're going to have basically one rod show up that's going to be equivalent to two rods. Okay, this is how rod tube is going to show up. The sweet thing about this and the twin tip technology is this is how it's going to come. One where the real seat is here and the main blank, main shaft there and you're going to have two tips show up. Now I'm going to go over in the next couple series here about ice fishing how I like to exchange these tips and how I like to use them but today's video I just want to talk to you about the rod itself. For the most part here I'll give you a little tip for the upcoming videos I use the medium action tip. Once you receive this, again, this is the one with the graphite, it's the graphite rod with the reel seat here. My reel is gonna be hanging down here. You just insert it there, press it in a little bit, and then I will line it up so it's gonna line up with the reel. Once we get a reel on, like this, sorry I was in the snow, put that in there, you're gonna screw that down I'm going to talk about this in a little bit of why I like the graphite rod or with the real seat here. And I'm going to line that tip up so it comes down right where the reel is. And there you have it. We have an ice fishing combo ready to roll. As I mentioned, there's two different tip selections, medium and medium light, for different lure types and bait presentations for multi-species angling or chasing after one species with different techniques like I mentioned. With a rubber cork handle and a foregrip along with your reel seat, the one cool feature of this is a highly visible strike tip design. That's that yellow or neon tip on there for light bites, action, stuff like that. It's lightweight, powerful, and sensitive. It has the Cast Flex IM6 Graphite Blank. The other rod series is the Linear Ice Rod. Here today I have the Hard Water Ice Rod, again with the graphite and the real seat. Main differences is here is color. Obviously we have a black main shaft with your hot neon strike action tip. With the Linear Ice it comes with more of a baby blue and your action tip is a hot orange. It's a pencil grip shaped 3A cork handle. So there is no real seat here. The advantages of this is your rod setup is gonna be a lot lighter, increasing sensitivity. To attach your reel, you're going to be using electrical tape or high strength rubber bands to make sure your reel stays in the right option. So this rod here is graphite. The other rod that I mentioned and shown here before is glass. So you're going to have a little bit more parabolic band and stuff like that. Both with assembled length come at 27 inches, handle length at 12 inches, tip length at 16 inches. Both come with your medium and medium light power tips. As you can see here, there's a little bit of weight difference and stuff like that, but there's the same amount of guides and everything like that. So depending on how you like to ice fish and how you like your combo set up, stuff like that, that's where you're going to choose between the rod and reel. For me, I enjoy a uh, reel seat that is tightened down by a screw. I don't particularly use the cork handle where you attach with electrical tape or attach with those high strength rubber bands. Doesn't mean there's nothing wrong with that, but that's just a personal preference for me. That's why I went with the graphite setup. If you're into a little bit lighter setup, more tungsten and finesse bait applications, and you don't mind attaching your reel to the rod with, again, electrical tape or high strength rubber bands, then I would definitely be able to look at the linear ice rod series or do both. I've actually been looking into more of the tungsten applications for panfish, uh, bigger crappies, and sometimes some walleyes as well, looking at that linear ice series. Right now, today with me, I just have the hard water ice series. If you wanna check out these rods, be sure to go to castking.com, look under fishing rods and their ice series, or just Google casking ice rods. They're gonna pop up with this series and the other series as well, the linear ice and the hard water ice. 
So thanks for watching the next video here that you're going to see in the Outdoors Living with Ethan series is you're going to be seeing the Casking Reels. I'm going to be diving into the ice reels that they have, ice spinning reels that they have available to you now. A couple different options for you to look at and again, putting it on your ice rod if you, that's what you're interested in. So thanks for watching. Be sure to check out all the other Casking videos coming across the channel. Awesome people doing fishing and other things across the nation and sometimes the world doing great things for you. So again, this is Ethan Preston, Pro Staff member here at Casking, and thanks for watching. Tune in next time.